I would like to thank the organizing committee for accepting our abstract for presentation in the conference. I will talk about the importance of using MRI as a predictor of nanoparticle concentration delivered to the brain following BBB opening via low intensity focused ultrasound in a RET model. The study was performed in collaboration with the research division of Insight Tech Company. I have no financial relationship to disclose. As we all know, GBM is one of the most infiltrating aggressive primary brain tumor. Unfortunately, care and therapeutic approaches have very limited effect on survival. As a neurosurgeon, I would like to emphasize that the advanced technology we are using in the modern operating room enables us to preserve the function of our patients, to relieve their symptoms, and to extend the extent of resection. However, extended resection does not change significantly the course of disease in patients with high-grade glioma. Due to the dismal prognosis of these patients, and failure of clinical trials in the past several decades to change the course of the disease, we are looking for innovative modalities to try and accomplish a breakthrough in the treatment of this devastating disease. In a previous publication by our group published in ACS Nano several years ago, we have shown that lipid nanoparticles can specifically bind human GBM cell lines and patient samples. LNPs containing siRNA PLK1 can downregulate the expression of specific genes in GBM cells in vitro. Local administration of LNP carrying siRNA PLK1 into GBM bearing mice resulted in a significant prolonged survival of these new mice. We realized that the current uh, platform could be potentially used for a large range of brain and CNS disease, and this platform can also carry different kinds of targeted therapy. We believe that this platform may shorten the path to clinical trials. In a more recent publication by Rosenblum et al., in collaboration with our group, we proved the impact of CRISPR LNP on aggressive glioma in a mice model. In this model, in, as in, in the previous study, the LNPs were administered in a local delivery into the tumors. However, since uh, the failure of previous clinical trials using local delivery, we realized that in order to advance our research, we should look for another method of delivery. We consider to harness the focused ultrasound technolo technology for BBB opening, which will enable us to deliver the nanoparticles systemically. Following uh, the success of transcal uh, MR guided focused ultrasound treatments for movement disorders, we have become interested in applying this technology to cancers of the central nervous system. McDonald et al. in uh, a recent publication in 2019 have uh, uh, showed us that the extablate neurosystem uh, may demonstrate actively controlled BBB opening that enhance carboplatin delivery in an aggressive and infiltrative rate uh, F98 glioma model. Based on this preclinical pre study, clinical trials evaluating the safety and feasibility of this technology were initiated. Other groups have also reported the, and supported with other devices the production of a low-intensity ultrasound to open the BBB. Previous study generally presents specific acoustic parameters that must be met for effective transfer to different sized molecules through the BBB. The aim of our current study is to predict the precise quantity of the therapeutic agent that will effectively reach the targeted area during and after the BBB opening treatment. 
in the current study, we used the low intensity uh, MR guided focused ultrasound Exablate 4000. BBB opening were performed using this apparatus, and the Delta R2 is typically used as a safety measure to detect treatment related patechial hemorrhage during BBB opening. In the present study, we propose utilizing the Delta R2 to measure and predict the effectiveness of BBB opening during treatment. In a recent publication in Communication Biology by uh, uh, Plaxin et al., our group uh, demonstrated this prediction value of nanoparticle concentration in the brain following BBB opening. We used three populations of liposomes carrying gadolinium. The experiments uh, were performed uh, on a RET model, and we demonstrated successful correlation between the delta R2 values and parenchymal concentration of these different sized uh, uh, liposomes carrying gadolinium ranging in between 18 nanometer and 44 nanometers. Our future plans is to experiment and explore the same dynamics with therapeutic molecules of nanoparticles carrying siRNAs or CRISPRs based on our uh, previous experience. One more goal is to establish the same result in a large animal model, and we hope that this strategy will mature eventually to a clinical trial and become a new therapeutic modality for GBM patients. I would like to thank the colleagues in my lab at Shiba Medical Center and uh, my colleagues in uh, Michael Plaxin Lab at Insight Company. Thank you for your attention.